Have, happy Friday, everybody. So I just have a couple cards here. Not a lot, just a quick reading that came out last night. thought I would share uh, just the significance of the energy. And I'm really feeling it in the masculine collective. My masculine's like very bold and just... Yeah, that's the word that's coming up is bold. Okay, and yeah, <laughs> just be more bold. And okay, so straight off right here. Okay, we've got seven of swords towards the four of wands. Okay, similar to over here, we've got the death card, knight of swords, six of cups. So after a major transformation of like this masculine, this group of masculines, rebirth going through a rebirth it's like a reset okay their transformation knight of swords okay quickly it's like jumping on that uh that bike there okay being led by spirit it's moving forward quickly towards the six of cups okay which is uh six of cups is like nostalgia, memories, reconciliation, uh, his love, okay? And then we've got two really major arcanas here, temperance and judgment. Like, wow. So divinely timed with temperance, okay? Temperance is like divinely timed as well. Like, his awakening is divinely timed basically <laughs> okay uh so being led by his higher self okay we have three of pentacles here as well so this is wanting to collaboration and work together like work together as a team so and i've been feeling that kind of like sneaky <laughs> not a bad way <laughs> but like sneaky like surprising kind of energy with the four of wands it's like and it's almost like his feminine is just you know holding it down kind of way like holding holding that four of wands like union energy 5d energy okay high frequency and i mean we do have halloween coming up too so a little bit of just sneaky energy but he's he's strategically something strategically going towards his union okay okay so the main reason I wanted to share this message is because last night I was pulling cards and I was like okay masculine what do you want what do you <laughs> what do you want to say what what what's up you know and it was just very bold how it came out. Okay. The emperor. What came out was the empress and the sun. Okay. So the emperor, the masculine, he's like, yeah, I want, I want you. You know, like I want the empress. I want my empress. And I want to be, I want to see her like, oh, you know, <laughs> just, just laughing because the message is so, it was, it was cute. Okay. It was really cute. And the fact that we have the sun, that happy, just blissful energy, and the star, destiny, healing, uh, it's like the fates, okay, it's fated. And the emperor's just sitting over here like, well, yeah, <laughs> I just thought it was very funny. And he's sitting, look, it's like right next to the four of wands, death, temperance, and judgment, main energy here. And then we also have the Ace of Swords. So he has clear, the most clear, I think just the most clarity he's ever had ever about some, about who, who his Empress is. And yeah, I mean, it was just so cute. It was so cute and funny. Um, let's see what's at the bottom of the deck here. Six of Pentacles. So, yeah, wanting to balance things out. Giving and receiving a balance. Okay, so just a quick little message. I just thought it was very, very cute. 
and endearing and just like hilarious. Like I feel like they're just being, they're being led to like go the distance, like be more bold in their life and going towards his wish fulfillment, his six of cups. Look at how he is going towards his six of cups and he's going towards a union. And he knows that this is his wish fulfillment. He knows that there's just great clarity and, and a little bit of humor mixed in. <laughs> like, like I know what I want kind of energy. Uh, I'm going to claim my empress. Like, what do you want to... What? what, 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 what? <laughs> and he straight up said, I want my empress. Emperor, you want your empress and you want the sun. What do you have to say? Like... I don't know what to say. <laughs> I don't know what to say with that. <laughs> Look at another deck, Queen of Swords, Divine Feminine. The Empress is like, okay, come over here. <laughs> There's just a lot of playful energy, humor. Uh, I don't know. It's I, I can tell you from experience, the Masculines are getting more bold. Good for them. Like, I'm. The energies are. It's different. Oh, look, I split the deck. We got the lovers. There you go. Okay. Yeah, King of Pentacles. Sitting. Sitting. Uh, just knowing. He's like smiling like. Haha. <laughs> Little does she know. Yeah, she's over there like Divine Feminine. You know. In her peace, tranquility, and meditation and not letting any of these just whatever trying to like interrupt her flow okay now we got the king of cups okay okay yeah all the kings all right when i say like the masculine is being bold funny all the kings are now coming out we got king of pentacles the king of cups i'm curious that's under the king of cups yeah three of swords in reverse letting out all of he wants to like yeah like ready to move forward look at his face all right just a quick message i thought that was hilarious and very very cute <laughs> the emperor wants his empress and he wants to be happy point blank period okay all right bye <laughs>